Well, context Excel with Mark. So in this video tutorial, we're going to be looking at how we can add the trend line in Excel. This element is invaluable when you need to make clear the neat visual representation of data trends. To use the trend line function in Excel, you're going to need to organize your data into the chart first. For more information on how you can make a bar chart or for some useful advice on making graphs, watch more of our videos that you can find in the link below. You can also find the links in the description. Now we're going to go through and how you can add a trend line into a chart. This video tutorial is also going to show you how you can form other trend line or how to remove it completely from the chart, just in case you don't need this anymore. We'll go through each step now, starting with the first one. To add a trend line to this bar chart, click on the graph. We're then going to click the green plus sign icon located on the right hand side, which opens a list of options. Here you can select or deselect various chart elements. We want to display the trend line, so hover over trend line and then click on the arrow that appears next to the text. Choose the trend line that you need, for example, linear, exponential, or any of the other types. In this case, we'll go for the first one, so we're going to click on linear. Once it's been selected, you can have a look at how we can format the trend line and change it depending on what we need. If you want to format the trend line, click on the line with the right mouse button, select Format Trend Line. On the right hand side, you'll see the task pane with more options. Here, we can take a moment to go through the basic ones. In the section trend line options, you can change the type of the trend line. If you need to change the color of the line, you can go to the section fill and line. Here you're able to change the desired color along with any transparency or width of the parameters that you need to do with your trend line. So let's close this task pane now and let's have a look at the last point of the tutorial on how to remove the trend line completely. All we're going to do is simply click on the chart. We're then going to click the green plus icon and the options, which you're already familiar with, should appear. Simply unselect trend line, and that's it. The trend line has been removed from the chart. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give us a like, and if you can watch any of the videos that you might find useful, that would be much appreciated.